for this evening, and welcome back to Paradise. So, I managed to put up some uh, stuff on my house to make it look better, and it's actually a lot safer now. I'm still on the lookout for creepers and such because I did not sleep through the night this time. But that's all right. Bam, baby. So upstairs is going to be my bedroom. It's a very small upstairs. I'm thinking about getting some brick to uh, finish off this area. Make it look nice. Since it's a modern day build, it, it's all right to have brick. Well, it's way out here in the boondock, so maybe we'll just do uh, regular, uh, do the regular thing I do. But it's not going to be um, medieval where it's like humongous roofs. So I'm going to try to keep from doing that. Um, down here is my living room slash kitchen. Uh, here's my kitchen area. Speaking of which, we do need to start making some mana steel tools. Uh, somewhere in my mana steel, right there, in my living wood. Alright, so I'm needing a mana steel axe. Bam, mana steel axe, very nice. Ooh, it also has nice attack damage, comparatively. Alright, next thing, I'm gonna want... I'm thinking that I want to make, uh... Hydrangeas next. Let's see here. Where's my book? There's my book, right there. So, the Man of Steel is actually extremely easy to make, but... We're going for Hydrangea. So... That's functional. Okay. Hydrangea. Basically, during rain it makes it faster, but still water. In a 3x3, three three, yeah, right. Mm. Okay. Let's see here. We need a pink, two cyan, no, three cyan, two blue, and pink. Three cyan, two blue, and pink. Cyan, blue, pink. Um, let's see here. That one here. And there's two pink. And there's blue. I don't have any cyan, surprisingly. Oh, I do. Okay. And how many holes are out there? Let's see here. One, two, three, nine. There's nine holes out here. So we're going to have to make nine of those flowers. Six, eight. So I am low on everything but blue, I believe. Let's take a look. How many blue do we need? Just two. One, two. Two, one, two. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There we go. Eighteen blue petals. And we're going to need nine. Oh, boy. So, uh, pink. I saw pink in this direction, I believe. So, let's be quick about it. Um, that's white. Owl, yellow, like that's light blue, I believe. Yep, that's light blue. Huh. Yellow, blue, green, pink, right. Okay. So I was right that the pink is in this location. And, um,. That's enough pink, though. Now we're going to need more cyan. Cyan looks like those right there. All right. We're going to need a whole lot of cyan. Bad chicken. Don't get in my way, chicken. Chicken, no, go, go, no, chicken. It's a spy chicken, don't you know? You should learn that by, uh, by now from watching Paul Sword Jr., 
he uh, he knows that they are spies. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, wait, one, two, ah, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right, all but five. One, two, three, four, five. Now we need nine seeds. That means more grass. Um. Let's shear some grass because I'm going to need them for some uh, pasture seeds. Now you're probably thinking, well, what do pasture seeds do, King Rivery? They're going to allow me to make uh, floating flowers, and uh, but I can't make them anytime soon. I have to get to the nether and get glowstone to make some glimmering flowers to make floating flowers. But um, basically, I'm going to make the Horn of the Wild to make searching for seeds and getting flowers a lot easier. Alright, uh, that's seven, eight, come on, we can do it, eight, nine. Okay, which way do we go? This direction is home. This direction is paradise. We must get to paradise fairly quickly because it's getting dark time and I do not want to be out here during a dark. Not until I get some armor at least. Guess what? Guess what, sheepy? Your wool is mine. <laughs> My wool now. Which I'm going to need for upstairs whenever I'm done anyways. So it is getting night time. Let's go sleep for the first night in my bed upstairs. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Now, whenever I die, I'll respawn up there. All right. Next thing we need is a water bucket. Here's my water bucket. Here's my water bucket. Okay. Um. So, put that, that, and that right there. Let's put the rest of those in here. Um, and then seeds on the end. That's how I do my little thing. So you grab that, put that in there. One, two, three. Oh, that's four, sorry. One, two, three. One, two, one, and one. You know what I'm doing wrong? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then half of those. And that's good. So, I have to make mana puddles. One. So, you make them like this. And the reason why I'm switching off like this is just in case I don't have enough mana. I'm sure hoping, because this is actually a few days worth of mana. Alright, so it should be... Oh my goodness. Like that. All right. So we put one, one, two, one, 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 and a C. And that gives me hydrangeas. All right, that was the last of the hydrangeas. Now, unless they've changed it in this recent update with all the Azure things, because as you guys know, Azar came in after episode one, uh, season one of the King Pack, which was the series I did, um, Botania in. I'm going back to Botania because of the brand new stuff that's within it. But unless they've changed it, we should be able to have these flowers like this, and it will not drain you of all your water. All right, so we will see. Actually, I need to go get my uh, Wand of the Forest again. Oh, wait, do I have it? No, I don't have it on me. Wand of the Forest. Where art thou, O oh, Wand of the Forest? There we go. Wand of the Forest, right there. 
Now, seems like those are good. And those seem good also. I'm thinking I'm going to need the spectacles to see the range of these things because if they're overlapping, then they're not going to work. Let's see here. That is increasing drastically. And that is doing well also. We might be able to make some more uh, mana steel tools. Actually, let's repair what I've got there. Um, function and repair. Will you repair for me? Uh, I think it's F3H. Yes, it's F3H. Uh, 224. Throw you in there. Wait a few seconds. Will it repair like that? 224. No, I have to have a, uh, a panel. Not a panel. A freaking mana tablet. There we go. But in the meantime, we can still make some mana tools. So, where's that living wood I had? Living wood. It's on me. That's where. One, two. That's going to be for the pick. One, two. That's going to be for the shovel. And then for the sword. All right. Now, where's all the iron? One, two, three, pick, one, shovel, two, sword, and I think that should be it. Pick, shovel, sword, pick, shovel, sword. Right. Oh, darn it. One, two, three, pick. Shovel, sword. There we go. Just need six iron ingots to be transferred into mana. And two, three, four, five, six. Yes! Yes! All right. Now let's make what we're after. So pick, shovel, sword. And I think that's a stronger sword. Yes, it is. Nice. Ha <laughs> ha, we're getting somewhere, lords and ladies. We're getting somewhere. All right, put that in there, that in there, that in there. Let's put our pick there, shovel, like that. Very nice. And then let's eat an apple. We deserve the apple. Oh, buddy. Oh, buddy, buddy. Time to share another sheep. Thank you, sheep. That's regular wool. Good, good. Sometimes I have trouble seeing it for white. Uh, being white wool. But at least I know it's white wool. Now, where's my Lexica? It is right there. Do I want to cut this? Wait. question is, what happened to my furnaces? Furnaces, where'd you go? There they are. Okay, I want to put the furnaces right there. And then let's take the charcoal, put it there, and one piece of wood to cook that chicken of mine. All right, while we are waiting, let's take a look real quick. I need something that will Okay, redstone root. And how do you get redstone root? Oh man, that's actually very easy. Uh, red in cyan. Red in cyan. I hope I have plenty of cyan. After my little trip. That's five cyan. I just need two. Alright. And then I need three red. Which I did pick up some red. That's good. Now if my dog would stop itching and causing so much noise. <laughs> one in there. And then I need one grass. Which I have. 
and one redstone, which I managed to pick up while I was mining for the iron. So we throw it like that, and now, actually, let's find out. What do we need? Two red manas. All right. One, two. And then my buckets. Right there, go in there, you, 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 and you too. Now we need a seed. I'm pretty sure we can easily get a seed just by farming here and throwing the extra seed in here. Voila, Belthor! So basically this will help protect my front door from mobs. All I have to do is plant it within the vicinity of the mana pool. I'm thinking we'll put it right there. Now with the wand, let's take a look. Yes, it is full. All right, that is very good. Very, very, very good. I am liking this. Now that we've got a little protection on our front door, I feel a little bit safer. Um. I think this one halts the creature. Yes, it does, but I require the Rune of Earth, which means I need the Runic Altar to make the Runic Altar. We need a diamond or a pearl, which I have done. Flower Pouch would actually be the next thing I need to make so I can just go around collecting flowers without a care in the world. Um, let's collect more wool again. Wooligan. <laughs> that should be a name, Wooligan. That'd be the worst name ever, actually. Wooligan. Alright, uh, I've got three wool. That's not gonna do me any good right now. I guess while we're waiting. Um, black lotuses can only be found. They cannot be grown or made. They can be found. Come from where cannot be grown or reproduced. But basically you throw it into a mana pool and it gives you some more mana. Alright. Um, I was thinking. Band of Aura. What do you need? You need that. Band of mana. You need a mana thing. Um, mana Seer. Ah, right. That's what I was wanting. A mana seer. So I need a mana glass and a mana ingot with three gold uh, nuts. So I need find my gold first. Okay. There's the uh, three gold nut nuts. One, two, three. One of those. And I need one of these. So I should be able to go make this. This will allow me to see the um, the area of effect that a flower has. So, if I remember correctly, it goes like that. There we go. See your monocle goes in the amulet slot. Inner parts. Yay! How do I look to you, good sir? It's a little low on my eye, I know, but I, I, I've got a small forehead. <laughs> oh boy. Alright. Well, hello there, old chap. <laughs> nice. Okay, so basically, the uh, Mana Seer Monocle. Handy tool for one who requires thorough window into where mana bursts are going. So basically, I'm going to get to see where the mana bursts are going uh, uh, all the time now, without having the wand in hand. Uh, the mana uh, uh, is going is the mana seer monocle. Not only is it rather fancy eyepiece, yes it is, <laughs> but it also allows the wearer to see all nearby mana bursts. Even if their line of sight towards them is blocked by something. Ooh, let's try that out. Ooh. Oh! I see it! <laughs> oh, hello. <laughs> okay. Oh, boy. 
Um, let's see. More important, perhaps, it's, uh, perhaps is that when someone wearing this monocle looks at a flower, they'll be able to see its functional radius. Now, that is exactly what I was after. Now, the ring of magnetism requires a magnet, requires a lens, requires mana steel, which would be four mana steel, one iron, one gold, and four more. That's eight mana steel we need. Do we have eight iron I can afford? No, I do not have eight iron I can afford. Which means I'm not going to be making the ring of magnetism this episode. But what we can do with this episode is decorate a little bit more inside my house. So, I'm looking for some wood. Haha, <laughs> wood, I do not have. Well, goody. Well, let's try living wood planks. I wonder how that would look in this house. Uh-huh. There, and let's try that. So, no, that's way too tall. It kind of looks like nether brick a little bit. Yeah, looks like nether brick. And then one right. Yeah, that's gonna be hard to move around in. Huh. 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 I've got an idea. Oh no. That idea is not going to work out as I was hoping. Um, I think that's the best I can do there. A very, very small amount of uh, ability. Um, I can't make planks using, I mean, uh, sticks using those. I, I, no, the only one. Kind of not something I was looking for. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's see if I can do something like that. Make it look a little fancier. One there, and one up there. And then take that only one we have. It's kind of, uh, yeah, that's not bad. It's kind of cool, in a way. All right, so that's kind of our kitchen area. Hmm. And all we got for the kitchen area. It's... Let's see here. Chopping board we'll need. Uh, grinding stone maybe it's called? I don't know. Nah, I'm not gonna use that. We do need uh, some chairs. But my issue is... I need more wood. <laughs> well, I think that's gonna be it for this episode. So, if you, uh, if y'all chat, really, that, that didn't match at all, um, if you all lads, I really don't know how to be English, really, okay, so, lords and ladies, if you guys enjoyed this episode, please leave a big bat like, if you haven't subscribed, come on and come subscribe, I will catch you, lords and ladies, next episode on Paradise, bye-bye now and enjoy.